still cold, which I like. And Kill Lifter is great because you're drinking local. I always appreciate, you know, Four Peaks, kind of a local brewery. Not not while driving with a straw in it. Do you know the First Amendment? I think you know it better than I do. I do. Can you state it? Yep. You're on the right. You're on the right. Don't resist, babe. Don't hurt him, please. Welcome to the John Legato Show. I'm John Legato. In the state of Colorado, you have to tell me what your name is. Don't come out or I'm going to tease you. This is sovereign citizen Chase Allen of Utah. He chose death about a month ago rather than handling his driver's license over to police. He had a gun and gave officers no choice. Okay, step out of the car for me. No. Sir, step out of the car right now. Step out of the car. We're going to break the window and pull you out. Gun, 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 gun. Today's sovereign citizen encounter with the police takes place in the neighboring state of Colorado. Yes. Are you threatening us? No, but if you don't want to give me your information, no. then you're going to go in cuffs. And then I'll... No, uh, no one has any... You can't be hanging out in front of a school and not tell me who you no. are. I Either you come out or I'm going to pull you out. I don't follow no, military so orders. And if you I am not in the military. All right, no out. Idea. Do not touch me. Do not assault me. Either you come out you or you're going to be tased. Immediately. Oh my I'm not going to fight with you. Come out or you'll be tased. Frank, do you need to step it up? One more time, ma'am. Don't tase. Well, then come out of this car. I am not going to play this game. Either you get out or you come out. This traffic stop occurred in Colorado. Now, sovereign citizens truly believe that they are above the law and don't have to follow the law. But what is the law in Colorado concerning stop and ID? Here are three things to know about Colorado's stop and identify laws. One, if you are driving and get pulled over for an alleged traffic violation, you are obligated to show the police officer your driver's license, registration, and proof of insurance if they ask. Refusing to give your identifying information to police during a traffic stop or detainment can be a contributing factor that leads police to arrest you for obstruction of justice. Or your girlfriend or whomever she is. Justify assaulting a peaceful being. Do you have... Come out or I'm going to tase you. You are disobeying a lawful order. Come Please. out or I'm going to tase order. you. Please come out. This it is, is not order. a lawful order. It is an order under color I'm of done. law. I'm done. Come out okay. or I'm going to tase you. Now. Okay, please. Okay. Put your hands on this head now. We're gonna put you now. Hands. Under threatened arrest, these people are now. threatening me. Right now. now. You're under arrest. We're going to detain you. Please don't resist detain arrest. Me under then what you authority? will be arrested. Put your hands behind your back now. Now, please. We're going to ask you one I more time. I am a peaceful being. I understand. That. Stay right there. No. Stay right there. Come on. Come on. I am peaceful. I am harming no Thank you, ma'am. No Thank you. You're not under arrest. We're just detaining you right now. Ma'am. I am harming no one. Please, ma'am. Don't let him be called. Thank you. Please, thank you, ma'am. Right thank you, thank you. Every situation is different, and you're going to hear what caused the officer to stop this individual and ask for an ID. You be the judge if you would do the same thing. Here's the deal. You're either going to give me your name or you're not. Either way, you are under arrest because you're going to be charged with resisting and obstruction. Not only that, you refuse to get out of your car, even after I ask politely. Mm -hmm. On top of that, order. I'm, not I'm stop talking. Military. It is my turn now. Other than that, you're parked in front of a school, children are on the playground, and then you don't want to tell me who you are, which makes me think that you're here to abduct children. Walk back to my car. No, we're not going to no, walk not. back to I'll your show car. We're past that. I'll show you. We're past that. I'm past that. I'm past that. I'm past that. I am past that. No, it's not too late. I am past that. No, you're assaulting me, and this is a No, ma'am, we're not assaulting you, ma'am. We're trying to be respectful And do you know Okay, right now? I feel like somebody pat her down. I haven't done that. Your authority. Now, please, I'm asking you, please do not resist her. Let her pat you down. This I'm gets not you taken. Can you hold that for me, please? Kidnapping and okay, assault. Okay. Well, your I'm husband, boyfriend, whomever. I'm resisting your crimes. Yes, yeah, and that is a crime. You cannot resist police officers. Please stop molesting well, me and assaulting me. Yeah. And not killing her. Yeah, okay. And then she's failing to identify Is herself. Yeah, I'm just going to the vehicle. Okay. Those. No, get no, in. Go, stay in. You are injured. Go, get, get in. in. So, she Five didn't... Your actions, you're going to pay me one million silver dollars. 
In case you missed it, the sovereign citizen just charged the police officer one million silver dollars for wasting her time. Just for the record, this is a pretty common threat by sovereign citizens, but they have never received a penny. But if this lady did get a million silver dollars, many of us might go rogue. The John Legato Show is being broadcast from outside the gates of Marine Corps Base Camp Lejeune in beautiful North Carolina. If you like the show, subscribe. doesn't cost you anything, and we don't ask for personal information. Semper Fidelis.